Hey, what's up everyone? Hewitt Graphs. Sean Hewitt coming at you with uh, one from yesterday that I didn't do because uh, I was to the in-laws house. I actually posted it on Facebook already and uh, one from today I'll show you yesterday is via the home address. It's Brandon. I'd never, uh, I'd have to like hear it said, but I don't know if it's Nemo or Nemo. I think it's Nemo though. If I can't get a good, good spot out of it. But the signature turned out real good. And uh, right here, first guy did not sign in my designated area but same thing signature turned out real good even though it's not quite where I wanted it here we go so pretty sweet card though right here we got Tony Danza He's doing that honeymoon in Vegas. I think that's the name of it. That play. That's pretty neat. And then he signed two index cards. I had to look at it for a minute. I was like, that's definitely not Tony Dungy's autograph. I'm trying to remember who I had wrote to. But all of them turned out good. I was going to show you a few things that I picked up. I um, pick, actually picked this up a few days ago. I was going to show it. But real cool. found it at Lids. It's uh, Miguel Cabrera. I think it's 29. The, the 29 uh, set. But it's uh, one of the brown chase silver slugger version pretty neat number 292 so that's really 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 cool all these things I want to take them out of the package I mean I don't really plan on getting rid of them but I mean I understand keeping them in there keep the value but I mean, what's the point of having them if you're not going to stand them up and display them you know, I don't get that. I have a bunch that I haven't taken out and I'm just torn. You know, my boy dolls. We'll say that one for a breeze. No, ain't. it's my boy dolls. These ain't action figures. Not action figures. Action figures would move. Like, an action figure should swing. Swing that bat. So we'll just call them boy dolls. Boy toys something like that but anyways move on from the rambling I found a Olympics Paul Korea bobblehead real sweet right there Paul Korea was always one of my favorite players got it for five dollars so you can't beat that right there um definitely take all my bobbleheads out of the cases They're, you don't have to destroy the case in order to display them like McFarland's or starting lineups and another one that I picked up for five bucks a lot bigger one it is a uh, Ray Whitney it's hard to see the actual dude but it's pretty sweet so like I said I got a lot of boy dolls <laughs> a lot of boy dolls um always always have had a place in my heart those have so uh yeah that's what i got today i didn't really expect a whole lot due to all the shit i got yesterday so i'm not disappointed i need to take a step back anyways spring training is about to hit so should be picking up so you know what Psh, hewitt graphs Psh, Psh, cutting out later